YouTube. In this video, I'm going to debunk something that I hear said a lot. And it's that to know if someone is a fake natty, you just have to look at their lips. And if they have very bad lips, they're very, they're very weak, but they're big, then they're definitely on steroids. This and the problem I have with this mentality is that it doesn't take into consideration leverages, the length of the limbs, the insertion of the muscles, but also the way the person trained. It has become quite popular to say that there is no such thing as an hypertrophy rep range and that becoming strong will get you big. I agree with that to an extent. I think that if you mainly focus on strength and you do all your reps within a certain rep range, you will gain size, but you won't get as, as much size. For example, let's say you only focus on one rep max front squats and you do them every time you go to the gym all right let's say you go once a week all right let's take the person who trains for strength they do that and they go 30 times to the gym and the 30 time they go they do 275 plus one time they did each time one rep of 275 with the warm-up sets all right now let's take someone who, ta who trains for hypertrophy and they do 225 for five. They will do 225 five times, times 30. Now compare the amount of volume done. Yes, that person is stronger on the one rep max, but in total volume and in weight moved, the second person moved much more weight. In your opinion, which one is going to grow your muscles the most? I personally believe it's the volume that grows your muscle. That's what matters, doing lots of reps during a long period of time. That's what is going to hypertrophy the muscles. So anyone who tells you, oh, well, that person has very big legs, but they have very weak squat, so therefore they're on steroids. These people don't understand what strength is. Strength is not moving something once. It can be moving it five times, or it can be the ability to move it several times during the week, or it can be the ability to do it several times during the workout. It has a completely different meaning between bodybuilding and powerlifting. So that's something that we should give up on as natural lifters, because this is not a good indication that someone is a fake natty. Please discuss it in the comments and if you feel like it and let me know what you think. Have a good day.